four on the day it came out. I am that lucky, but um, I'm not here to brag, but okay. I'm gonna be talking about vehicles. And as you can see, I'm just gonna show you this gun. It's a, uh, um, dang it, I forgot its name. It's something, uh, I'm sorry, but it's, I don't know, it's, I forget it. I think it's Storm Rifle, and uh, there's a new zoom in thing, and thing for the, um, uh, whatchamacallit, plasma pistol, but um, I'm gonna go ahead and move to the Mo Mongoose. A lot, or right now, it's way smoother than in Halo Reach, and I think it's, I think the modeling is really nice and good, and as you can just, you as you can see, you can just like drift around and stuff and be all cool. But like in the other Halos, you couldn't really do this. Like, you couldn't easy drift. There was like no point of drifting. But now there is. You can be all, you know, cool. And then, I'm just gonna parallel park. Actually, no, I'm not gonna parallel park. I'm not good. Okay, but here is the um, back of a, uh, what's it called? Warthog. And yeah, it looks really nice and it's also really smooth, like the mongoose, but you know, has to be a little bumpy. So yeah, and of course it's not as fast because it has all this gear. And the drifting is the same, basically. It just drifts a little harder on this. Like, it has more of a drift. Like, on the Mongoose, it didn't have as big of a drift. Because, like, if you do the um, joystick to the right too much or to the left too much, it really goes out quite crazy. And, yeah, and you can just cruise around on this, killing people with the turret and stuff. Now I'm going to show you the turret. It's a really nice aim, I have to say. And also, I like this, how it gets faster by, like, seconds. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and drive my ba my way back to the, um, you know, vehicle place. Oh, no. Oh, oh, no. Oh, dang it. I thought I was going to actually survive. This should have been last, but I mean, it was like third on the list. So, this is the Scorpion, and it's really big, and it like really forces its way through stuff. And it's really hard to run over people because they, well, let me just do this. Because they would just like move out of the way instantly. Why would they stay there? I don't know why. If they would, because it, it, you see it coming. But if you were to smush someone, they would, oh my gosh. Okay, but you can see the aiming is different. And also, this is also a little smoother. And of course, it drifting, I mean, doesn't really happen with the tank. But I'm going to go use this ghost as a shooting target. And that's how powerful it is. Let me try and find, oh, Mongoose. Still, I'll shoot that Warthog. Well, bam, it's just, and now you can actually see the bullet instead of it just like teleporting to place to place. It's a little slower, the bullets are a little slower. And yeah, go ahead and forge my way out of here and I'll go ahead and delete it cause it's that big, I mean, serious. Half my items just like gone. Oh man! But I'm gonna go ahead and move to the. I say this is an awesome thing, and it's the new vehicle in Halo series, and it's called the Mantis. It is amazing. Okay, so you press LT to uh, fire a missile, a missile. Don't just like spam it because you really can't. And then while that's reloading, you can just be shooting this giant assault rifle that is like has huge bullets and then when it finally finishes you're like bam back to destroying and you can just be like bam it's it's amazing and also another feature is you can be like 
Man, I'm the Hulk. I'm awesome. And you can just like stomp. Wait, I want to see something. Well, that's dang. And also, you're like crazy. You can do this. Yeah, it's yeah. Look how strong this is. It's amazing. But it also has that meter right below the aiming. So watch that. And it just the missiles you can't you don't really do it because it doesn't have or it has it has to reload and stuff you know. And I'm gonna go ahead and move on with the ghost. I think the animation of it getting out is also really cool. But as you can see, the ghost is a little more uh, detailed and darker. And it's a, no a lot smoother. And the bullets, they seem harder. Like, they're smaller and they seem more compact because it vibrates a little more and shoots a little faster, but not really. And now you can uh just like i think you go faster whenever you boost and then um there's a boot there's a boost sharp or chart at the top left corner but maybe you can't see it maybe you can because i mean i don't know so sorry and then moving on with the banshee the Banshee is a more lighter color and it's a little harder con to control. First of all, if you're playing a big team battle, I learned this the hard way. And you're flying around trying to destroy stuff, you come into a mantis, that mantis will blow you up so hard. And okay, and it's a little harder. To just, you know, press the LB and stuff and it'll roll and stuff and eventually you might be able to take that down. And then you press Y. You go to the Banshee Bombs. This is like the best thing about a Banshee. It's almost cheating too. Oh what? It went straight. It's not supposed to. And then you press Y again and then it's the ghost. But the ghost bullets but a little bigger and they shoot a lot faster. Okay and... With the ghost, there's also a meter at the top left corner. Maybe you can see it, maybe you can't. Sorry if you can't. Uh, and all right if you can. And then this is the wraith. I'm kind of in a rush, sorry. And it, you can really see the bullets a lot better because it's freaking awesome. And whoa, did you just see, oh my God, that was cool. Like that, yeah, that's cool. Let me see something. Oh, but um, that's basically it. Wait, let me let me see the turret. Oh, as you can see, there's a really fast bullets and they're big. I've never actually seen this turret because I never bothered in Halo 4. This is my first time seeing the turret. Same here. Same here, guys. Same here. <laughs> and then I remembered it from Halo Reach because I'm like, oh, yeah, turret. Nah, oh, bump. Okay, and let me see. Oh, Wraith, Banshee, Ghost, Mantis, Scorpion. Okay. Last but not least is the Shade turret. They, like, changed it completely then in, like, Halo Reach. It's completely different, and look at this. It's a lot faster, a lot harder shots, and your vi your controller vibrates like crazy. It's not over, uh, thing, thing too, cause like, it doesn't turn that fast. But you could just do this, but someone can actually just hijack you, I think, and yeah. And that's it, and Peace out. Wait, let me kill myself. Peace out. <laughs>